So, Jeff Gordon, um, is this your first Hall of Fame? As far as I'm aware, yes. Okay, so this is the first of probably many Hall of Fame appearances. Well, you're very kind. I appreciate that. Um, I, I, I guess I hope so. I, I, I can't necessarily confirm anything on that. <laughs> I'm, uh, this may be the first Hall of Fame that Jeff Gordon is inducted into, but there will be many more, I'm sure. Right. But you got dibs on him first. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, he thought that was pretty cool. I think that was just a fluke of the calendar that uh, we happened to get him first because I'm sure there will be many more to come. I mean, I, listen, it, this is, regardless of anything else going on, this this is an honor. You look at the, the list of um, people that have been inducted into this Hall of Fame, and it, it's obviously a very broad spectrum with covering so many different types of motorsports. Um, I'm thrilled. I'm, I'm honored. And, um, you know, it's an, an elite class tonight, too, to be a part of. Yeah, I wanted to ask you about that. Uh, you're going in with Howard Hughes. <laughs> I mean, did you ever think in your wildest imagination that you'd be in a Hall of Fame in the same class as Howard Hughes? Not a, not a chance. Not a chance. But, uh, uh, you know, I think, again, that shows you the diversity and, and how broad the spectrum is of motorsports in general, but certainly also this, this Hall of Fame. And so... Um, there's a lot of cool people here and a lot of cool inductees. I tell you what, Jeff is uh, uh, an unbelievable guy, great driver, and uh, he, obviously his record speaks for itself. And uh, really proud to be his teammate for several years at Hendrick Motorsport. And uh, uh, really still can't believe I was able to meet him one year for the championship. But uh, as good as he was, that was quite an accomplishment for our team. So, uh, But I'm proud of Jeff. He's a great guy, did a great job. It's going great. I mean, luckily, you know, I'm. I'm very active with Fox, so I'm a part of the broadcast, which makes the transition a, a, a good one because I get to still be a part of the competition, just calling the race, uh, you know, from from the booth, which has been fantastic. I'm still very involved with Hendrick Motorsports, so that keeps me involved in the competition side. I'm really busy with Exalta and, and you know traveling all over the world with with them and. And involved with motorsports, so yeah, I'm, and then you know, two kids and my wife, we're, they're keeping me all very busy. So it's uh, I, I'm anything but but sitting back in a rocking chair on, on the porch. So yeah, dur- during that the second half of the season, I'm very involved and, and, and active with Hendrick Motorsports and more more meetings and uh, you know discussing the business side of, of things with uh, with those folks, but. Luckily, I, I'm in a position to take a little time off with my family during the summer. And, and so last summer we went to Indonesia, and this summer we're going to Greece. So take a little bit of time off, and then it's back to work. 